Hi, Stephen Webster here. This year marks 15 years since the launch of our most successful collection. This is Fly By Night and this is the story. People ask, is a fly by night a butterfly? Is it a moth? Is it a bat? I'm gonna leave that up to you. We just call it fly by night. Here we have an original fly by night piece. It's a brooch. Within this brooch are all the things that surround fly by night. It's got small fly by nights, little diamond ones, flying around the diamond set for it, so it's definitely a fantasy. So this was really the origins of Fly By Night. How did Fly By Night evolve? Not everything evolves into a tiara, but Fly By Night did. This was actually worn by 175 Ebiton Chorus at the Opera Ball, really spectacular. This is the biggest selling piece of the collection. It's really, really glamorous. It's very colorful, but it's kind of got an edge to it. This one here, it's got black diamonds, so that's around the outside. The blue, which is really the bit that draws you in, the bit you can see across the room if someone's wearing it. This is black opal, underneath dome of faceted quartz, and it's a technique that I created called Crystal Haze. So this one has the black opal. Here, we've got Peruvian ink opal, also known as angel skin now is a white mother of pearl because fly by night is so distinct so noticeable and it's been around for 15 years it's been worn by many many celebrities in no particular order doja cat amelia dims jenny ruby jane and anya taylor joy because fly by night has been so successful this story definitely hasn't ended